Hi, you're watching Real Loop. I'm Gina Morelli. Here's January's real estate market update for Coos and Curry County, Oregon. In Coos County, comparing 2021 to 2020 through January, the average sales price has increased 24% to 293200 In the same comparison, the median sales price has increased 27.3% to 276000 We have 1.5 months of inventory compared to 2.7 months of inventory this time last year. 70 homes sold for an average of 99.61% of the listing price and 98.42% of the original price, averaging 51 days of total market time. In Curry County, comparing 2021 to 2020 through January, the average sales price has decreased 0.9% to $312,000, and the median sales price has decreased 0.2% to $310,500. We have two months of inventory compared to six months of inventory this time last year. 38 homes sold for an average of 96.95% of the listing price and 95.66% of the original price, averaging 96 days of total market time. While Coos County came in at a higher price growth than the national average, Curry County deviated from national trends with a small decrease in prices since last year. According to the latest report from Black Knight, 6.48 million households have entered a forbearance plan as a result of financial concerns brought on by the pandemic. Right now, according to Mortgage Bankers Association, 51.7% are paid in full, 33% worked out a repayment plan, 15.3% are still in trouble. There are still 2.77 million borrowers in a forbearance program. There are, however, three major reasons why experts believe there will not be a tsunami of foreclosures as we saw during the housing crash over a decade ago. Almost 30% of borrowers and forbearance are still current on their mortgage payments. Banks likely don't want to repeat the mistakes of 2008 to 2012 when they put large numbers of foreclosures on their books. This time, many will instead negotiate a modification plan with the borrower, which will enable households to maintain ownership of their home. With the significant equity homeowners have today, many will be able to sell instead of go into foreclosure. Will there be foreclosures coming to the market? Yes. There are hundreds of thousands of foreclosures in this country each year. People experience economic hardship and in some cases are not able to meet their mortgage obligations. We're now entering 2021 with 320,000 fewer homes for sale than we entered in 2020, while buyer demand remains extremely strong. If we do experience a higher foreclosure rate from those in forbearance, most experts believe the current housing market will easily absorb the excess inventory. Coos and Curry County data sourced from RMLS.com and national data and slides are sourced from Keeping Current Matters. If you'd like to know more, feel free to send us questions or post comments. We're always looking for better ways to serve our community and hearing from you helps us do that. Stay safe and keep an eye out for next month's market update.